Hey there, travel enthusiasts! Have you ever gone on an amazing trip but failed to keep a proper travel journal? Well, fear not, because in today's video, we're going to embark on a journey through time and relieve my unforgettable adventure in the mesmerizing city of Fez, Morocco, even though it happened way back in 2018. That's right, it's never too late to document your travels. You see, during my trip to Fez, I was so caught up in the moment, soaking in the vibrant culture, the bustling markets, and the captivating architecture that I neglected to keep a written journal. But now, armed with my trusty scrapbook supplies, old tickets, brochures, and a treasure trove of photos, I'm going to take you on a behind-the-scenes look at how I'm piecing together this magical experience. So grab your favorite crafting supplies and let's get started on this scrapbooking adventure together. Whether you're a seasoned traveler or just dreaming of your next getaway, this video will inspire you to preserve your cherished memories in a unique and creative way, even if you didn't have the foresight to document them in real time. You can still prepare a scrapbook-style travel journal by reviewing the supplies you have on hand thoroughly. Here, I have the travel itinerary provided by our travel agent, a brochure with some information about Morocco, a ferry ticket, and photos. As you sort through your supplies, try to recall the specific details, emotions, and stories associated with each one. Jot down any recollections that come to mind no matter how small. These snippets will help bring your pages to life when you start journaling. Now, you're seeing me decorating this page using these large alphabet stamps to spell out the word Morocco on the leftmost part of the spread from top to bottom. I like putting the name of the place on the first page as a starting point, creating a bold and eye-catching focal point that sets the tone for our scrapbooking adventure. I'm shading the stamps using this yellow-orange brush marker because I want my fast journal pages to have a hint of this warm, vibrant color to create a unified theme throughout. Next, I'm browsing through the Pepin Press stickers and tapes booklet with European tile designs to choose a sticker that I can add to my page, aiming to incorporate Moroccan patterns and motifs into my scrapbook layout. I chose this floral pattern tape with an almost similar shade of the yellow-orange brush pens that I used to color the alphabet stamps, helping to tie the color scheme together and create a cohesive look.
Next, I want to add this brochure as a tip in in the middle of this page, securing it with a clear tape. You can also use a decorative washi tape for a pop of color and pattern while adhering ephemera like brochures, maps, or tickets to really bring the travel memories to life within the scrapbook layout. I'm using this vintage map scrapbook paper to add decoration to the corner of the right page, tearing off the pieces of the paper instead of using scissors to create a more organic, distressed edge that complements the travel theme. This technique adds visual interest and texture to the layout, helping to incorporate patterns and colors that tie back to the Moroccan inspiration.
I'm stamping the word FES inside a label sticker to add to this page, creating a clear visual identifier for the specific city that will be the focus of this scrapbook pages and memories. also like using different colors of pens to write important keywords and locations like the sites we visited in FES onto the page. This helps those key details stand out. To capture the lively spirit of our visit to the bustling Medina market in FES, I'm adding a touch of whimsy by using this Sakura Lala clear stamps featuring playful illustrations. further personalize the page and capture the special occasion, I'm adding more accents using clear stamps with a birthday theme to document the celebration of my dad's birthday that took place during our time in FES, blending the travel memories with this meaningful family milestone.
there you have it by combining old travel memorabilia photos and a dash of creativity we've embarked on a journey through time resurrecting the vibrant sights and sounds of fast morocco this just goes to show that it's never too late to document your adventures no matter how much time has passed so i have to ask What's your favorite travel memory that you've been meaning to preserve but haven't gotten around to yet? Share your stories in the comments below and let's keep this scrapbooking inspiration flowing. Until next time, happy travels and happy journaling.